Hi guys, this is a very short video about uh, shoulder, uh, shoulder ligaments. The first ligament to talk about is the glenohumeral ligament, which is this ligament here. It has three different parts, but they're pretty much all together. It has the superior, middle, and inferior, but it's um, pretty much just the glenoid cavity connected to the humerus, which is why it's known as the glenohumeral ligament. Um, the one ligament on the shul on the humerus is this one here and this is known as a transverse humeral ligament so those are the two ligaments um now we can move to the scapula um before moving to the scapula i'd like to remind you that um if you watched my um scapula um tutorial you know that this is the coracoid coracoid um, process and the one below it, this one, I'll rotate the structure. This is known as the chromium um, uh, process, which is this this structure here, this AG1, this is the chromium, and uh, this is the clavicle, um, if you recall. Knowing that, um, it's very easy if you know that. Um, pretty much this this ligament here that connects the um, coracoid process to the humerus is known as the coracohumeral ligament. Um, the, the structure that connects the coracoid to a chromium, this one is known as the coracochromial ligament. Very easy, just gonna connect the names. Um, and then this is the clavicle, as I mentioned before. So this ligament here connects the chromium to the clavicle, which is why it's known as the chromial clavicular ligament. Now, there's one ligament here, which is known as the trapezoid ligament. Just got to memorize this one. And also, um, again, from the bone tutorial, this structure here, um, if you recall, was the canoid uh, tubercle, uh, just the bone itself, which is why this is known as the canoid ligament. And also one last structure here. Um, this is known as the superior transfer scapular ligament and because if you recall this notch here was the supra subscapular notch so this is the superior transverse ligament the uh, scapular ligament well that's pretty much it um just know that under the um you know the glenohumeral ligament we got the synovial membrane of the shoulder joint but other than that it's pretty much it thanks for watching